What's up guys? I woke up from a nap. I don't ever take naps. This is a weird way to start out the video, I know, but it's all good. Go ahead and like the video and comment down great fam so I know you're part of great fam. Guys, today is going to be an awesome day. Today I'm going to conquer some goals. Today I'm going to finish some things I need to get done and I'm actually going to start right now because I got a lot to handle. I have two major videos that I need to get done and I also have a paper to type. I do got a lot going on right now, but I can't accomplish it. I got this. Let's do it. With that being said, I'm currently heading to the U.S. Postal, what is it, USPS, I don't know what the actual acronym is, but heading there because I ordered two new tripods, so I gotta go pick them up. There was some sort of problem with delivery, that's the reason why I have to go pick them up, but it's all good because two tripods are definitely needed right now. I've been ordering a lot of equipment lately, mostly just for projects that are coming up, and these things are definitely gonna help out a whole bunch, but I'm gonna pick these tripods up and then just see where else the day takes me. What's that, what's that thing called, do you guys remember, who's the kid who said, ooh, kill him? Not gonna lie, kinda looks like him, almost exactly like I, don't, I forgot his name though. Yeah, this thing barely fits in my back seat. I didn't expect this box to actually be that big, but I guess it is two tripods. And I'm sure the boxes, the tripods are in are pretty big as well. Time to get these bad boys home. Doing that. Uh, Look at the car. A dead body. Cruz, what is that? Tripods. That's why you said we could take my car. Yeah. You gotta make the drop. Sure do, sister. I haven't seen you in a while. What you been up to? Yeah, you know. Waiting to get married. True. I'm stuck. Wait. Too long, y'all. Back in this thing again. How to get some stuff? I'm just kidding. <laughs> some Listerine strips. Hi guys. We are here in the toothpaste aisle and the lotion aisle, where we're gonna debate on whether you should use this to brush your teeth or moisturize your skin. Brush your teeth or moisturize your skin. You pick. It's a good one. Welcome <laughs> to the <laughs> We went to the beach with our toes in the sand. And we might have not been countryside, but we were in New Mexico and that's kind of country. Okay? We can go to the beach in New Mexico. No, I said he's two different things. I can see this at the beach with the toes in the sand. Toes in the pan. Do your dance. You gotta do it. Do it. Do it. <laughs> She lives in. How was that? Amazing. Yeah. Yeah. Might get some straws for this. Does he mean 1738? <laughs> Okay, so let's get to the needy greedy on this video. I don't even know what the needy greedy. Pretty sure it means like the main deal. So I wanted to look at my haircuts because my wedding is actually next month. My wedding is next month, guys. That's insane. I'm getting married next month. It's February. I'm getting married in March. It's coming up. Logging into the computer right now, but I wanted to look at photos and show you guys some photos Let you guys comment down below what you guys think on everything on how I should get my hair cut who should cut my hair We're gonna figure it out. So pretty much a free haircut, which is from Diddy. He always hooks it up He always does a free haircut. I mean mostly we just do trades because I do I I sew so like I'll like sew his pants So I'll sew his pants and then he'll cut my hair compare that to going to a barber shop Which one would be best? We're gonna look at photos see if it's worth it I mean, honestly, it's only like $40 versus free. I think the only way we can figure this out is if we go into some of my photos. We'll go to Instagram. So this video is initially free haircut versus $40 haircut. The first haircut I'll pull up is one from Diddy because I think that was the most recent 
photo I probably have. So we'll just look at the comments already in this photo. Um, even though some people were like cool with it, some people were like, dude, this is busted. So, well, most of the people were down for it. Everyone was like really cool with it. And this is a haircut from Diddy. So uh, Amir said, too clean. Huahu Smooth said, S busted hairline, Brody. Enough love though. It doesn't, that doesn't make no sense, but someone said 100%. Someone said, a hey, nice fade. Um, there are a lot of good comments on that one. I actually don't have that many photos on my Instagram of when Diddy's cut my hair to actually show the fade. There should be one right here, but it's actually grown out a bit. So this is a haircut that Diddy gave me as well. And it was like a lower fade than usual. And this looks really clean. The cool thing about when Diddy cuts my hair, um, which is the free haircut, the fade is more of a low fade. And it like shows a really cool gradient compared to when I go to a barber shop. They'll put the gradient more high. So the, uh, so the fade when I go to a barber shop, they'll do it really high. And I'll show you what I mean in this next photo. So that is that one right there. That was a Diddy haircut. That was a free one. And then I'll show you guys a haircut that was expensive. Okay, so this obviously is a barbershop haircut that was $40. And I always tip the barber when I go to a barbershop because like, I mean, I think it's the cool thing to do. But in this photo, this was probably the crispiest fade I ever got. This haircut was by a man named Bevan. And this is who I plan on going for the wedding uh, to get my hair cut. So that was actually what I wanted to do. The barber actually hit up my brother Chandler and told him uh, that I should go to him and then that there's a loctician uh, nearby or in the barber shop. So I think that may be the way to go to get my hair cut from him and then go to the loctician right after. But I definitely wanted to compare the two uh, from a free haircut to a barber shop haircut. So like a free haircut to a $40 haircut. So this is $40, the picture before, the picture before was $0. And I'm gonna tell you guys 100% the truth. This is way cleaner than the free haircut. Reason being is because this one is done with a razor. This one was done with way more expensive uh, clippers, uh, more expensive shavers, and the haircut is super clean. And it's honestly just well put together. So this haircut right here in this photo, this was about a $30 haircut. This was actually when I was down in Liberal. This dude named Angel cut my hair. Angel's the barber who uh, cuts a lot of people's hair in Liberal. So this haircut was, I think, like $30. This is November 23rd, 2016, so it was a while back. But in this one, the photo doesn't really show the fade that well. But I think the biggest comparison is going from the free haircut to the $40 haircut, because you can definitely tell the difference big time. Yeah, I actually think that's just it right there. There's no really other photos that I can show. But the two biggest ones are the free one versus the $40 haircut. You guys comment down below what you think the best option would be. Should I go to Diddy, be like, yo man, you cut my hair for the wedding? Or should I go to the barber shop and make it look really clean? Honestly, I'm kind of leaning more towards that. I mean, Diddy's still in the beginner stages of uh, cutting hair, which is his haircuts are super clean. Um, the last one I got was actually from Diddy. It's already growing back in because I hardly ever get my hair cut. Um, I cut my hair probably like once a month, seems like. But especially since me and Kenneth are gonna be shooting photos and like the whole wedding party's gonna be shooting photos for the wedding. And I just want it to be super clean. So I think that may be the route to go. But you guys, comment down below what you guys think I should do. Just let me know in the comment section. I'll definitely show you guys some love. But with that being said, hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. If you guys did, give it a thumbs up. Other than that, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hopefully you guys have an amazing day. Matter of fact, have a great day. Peace out and God bless. Can you hear me? All right, guys, today we're at ASU shooting pranks. <laughs>